like one of my most vivid memories of Daily Bruin was when I was a freshman and I'd been working at the paper for a couple quarters and the rule is that they promote you after you've written like 20 stories in news and the news section used to have this sort of tradition where they'd kind of like haze you like not like seriously but like lightly um, when you became a reporter. Um, so I turned in my reporter application and was like waiting to like hear back about it and I get this call one night from a copy editor after I turn the story in and the copy editors are the people who like read your story, fact check it, make sure it's like good to go and so I get this call and it's just like a really angry person saying like this story is terrible like I can't, I can't believe you even write for us like how could you have turned this in I can't believe your editors let it go and I was like almost crying at this point because I just like felt terrible and I tried to explain about like my editor saying that the story was fine um, and then after like a couple minutes of just like basically having a heart attack he was like just kidding you're promoted and hand, handed the phone off to someone else um, and so that was just like very vivid in my mind because I like worked myself up so much and then it turned out to be fine in the end. Um, and that was like my first year at the Daily Bruin when I really kind of started to fall in love with like the paper and, and what we do here.